Hi guys, welcome to another video. Today, doing a uh, cheap versus expensive setup and pro versus noob photographer. I'm sure the title will be a little bit clickbait, but uh, yeah, this is my old camera body. And yeah, then I've got, what is it? Like 60 something millimeters of extension tubes and my dad's 50 millimeter Olympus lens from like the 90s, I think. Yeah, it's got the Olympus OM system. Zuiko 50mm f1.8 and it's like a fully manual lens and then I've got the my old flash young new YN 560 mark 3 and yeah a paper diffuser which I made probably about five years ago now I used to use this when I first started macro with a flash and it worked all right to be honest but with yeah it's not as good as the Cygnus tech diffuser I must say all right so before this video starts I want to state the rules I think it's fair that we do single shots, no focus stacking. I'm going to set the exposure on both cameras so we don't have to think about what we're doing. Um, but you can change it if you want. So we're going to be given 20 minutes each and we're going to see how many subjects we can photograph in that time. Now the aim is to get as many subjects as you can to win, but yeah. Honestly, the real winner might be the person with the better photos. So yeah, leave a comment if you think my photos are better or Sam's are better. But yeah, let's uh, get into the video then. Yeah, so uh, I'm gonna give myself 20 minutes and see how many subjects I can photograph. And then I'm gonna give Sam, who's behind the camera, my Cygnus Tech setup, my proper setup, and see what I can do in 20 minutes. Okay, 20 minutes begins. Let's see what I can do. Honestly, the weather is not um, great and it is late. Well, it's, it's September now, 1st of September. So, yeah, the weather and the season is not on my side. I'm probably just going to be finding like spiders and little things really around this time of year. Oh, yeah. So I'm going to get this little bit of paper right here because that that will stop light going upwards. Yeah, it's a bit scuffed this setup. The flash is too tall. The flash was a bit smaller, I think the setup would work. Just gonna analyze the leaves. There's gotta be something sitting on the leaves, surely. Can't see anything in this whole bush. Like a few, a couple months ago. Whoops. A couple months ago, I would have found loads of stuff in this bush. It's a sign that macro season is coming to an end. Or at least the bug season. Still do like fungus macro and that. Which I probably will do, stay tuned. Okay, there's a miniature spider. It's probably not going to be a great photo, but I've got to take what, I've, what I can get at this point. It's incredibly dark in the viewfinder, like I can barely see anything. And I can use live view, but it's just as dark. I'm going to have to leave that because I literally cannot see. 15 minutes left and I haven't even found a bug. Well, I have, but I haven't even managed to photograph it. There's a fly on there, but flies are known for flying, hence the name. Oof, not a great composition, but at least I've got something. I'm going to try and get a top-down shot of that. I think it's just about in focus. I could barely tell it's looking through this this uh, viewfinder. It's just pitch black. There is a little slug down there. Might as well photograph it just to get one on the scoreboard. I can't really see its face though. I'm having to sort of angle my flash to get as much light on the subject. All right, that'll do. I'm not going to get anything more better than that. There's a lot of spiderweb around here. I think there's a tiny spider up there, which I could get. There's a tiny fly on the top of it as well. Oh, the fly's gone. Looks like I'll go for the spider. I'm gonna have to go sideways because otherwise my light is not gonna hit it. Not a great photo, but there's another one. There's a miniature slug. Not a slug, miniature snail. Probably the smallest snail I've ever seen, to be honest. Oh, 
just about out of focus. I think one of those was in focus, I don't even know. I've said this many times, but yeah, I just, it is incredibly hard to, to see what is in focus and what's, what's not with this setup. If I was using an actual macro lens, it would have been all right, but I think it's the extension tubes. They make the image really dark, like it's hard to see. I'm having to use one over eight on the flash. And uh, usually on my Olympus setup, I'm using like one over 32. Halfway through, okay. <laughs> How many have I got? I've photographed like four. Not going too great so far. Could have a look on this side, but it's just, it looks like a wasteland. It looks like Chernobyl right now. Look at this. This is the summer. It looks like there's loads of dead, dead grass. Scott, I know there's like something hiding away. Literally all I've found so far is slugs, snails, and mini spiders. There we go. I've got a leaf hopper. You can always rely on leaf hoppers. They're about pretty much all year. Hopefully you don't jump away. <laughs> what was going on there then? Someone jumped onto my hand, bro. Leaf hopper complete. A uh, little slug. Uh, not gonna bother. Honestly, I could get that slug and get another one on the board, but you know, I'm giving you a chance, Sam. I'm giving you a chance. Crane fly right there, I could try and get that. He's only just landed and he's flew off again. So yep, death for that. How long have we got left? Eight minutes left. Eight minutes, okay. The past few photos have been a bit like half-assed, so I'll try and get some decently composed ones now. Crane flies back, or another, another crane fly. I think I got one in focus. Again, that wasn't a greatly composed shot. But crane flies, if you've ever photographed a crane fly, you'll know how hard they are to get a good shot of them. Okay, there's a spider here, but as usual, spiders are always facing downwards, so. I'm going to have to do this, but I can't use my, my viewfinder. There does, I don't think there's any live view boost. I had a look in the settings before I started the video, and I don't think the Canon 80D has the live view boost, so I can't see what I'm actually doing. So I might have to actually just bump the ISO up really high, and then bump it back down. I've got it in focus now, I think. Now I'm going to bring the ISO back down to what I had it at. Let's just double check that. That is extremely dark. Might have to bump the ISO up a bit. I'm gonna to go to 800. I'm gonna bump the shutter speed up a bit as well. Oh, how long have we got left? We have three minutes left. Three minutes. That photo might be the best one I've taken. Not ever, just <laughs> today. It's a bit darker than I hoped, but you know, um, I don't have time to get that good. I wanted to get on, need to get onto the next subject. I think there's a tiny snail on there. This might be my last photo. You got a minute left to do it. A minute. A minute. Oh my god, I can't even see. Not even going. Why is it pitch black? I literally cannot see what's going on. Oh, I'm in live view. I'm an idiot. That was quite a cool little, little snail there. I think that might be my last one. What are we looking at for time? Less than a minute. Less than a minute. Or the summit there. What the hell are those? Ew. I've actually never seen these before. They're like... Done. Oh, okay. Well, they're jumping about anyway, so I wouldn't be able to get those. Yeah, I don't know how many I got that got there, but I think... Let me flick through quickly and I'll, I'll say... Six, seven, eight... Yeah, eight. I got eight. 
which doesn't sound like a lot so that's like what nearly one every two minutes so um yeah you've got eight to beat some wet camera yeah. um hi uh i'm sam i'm the cameraman uh today i'm gonna be using the really expensive setup uh and i have only taken a picture of two leaves in uh macro so yeah that's, that's about what we've got this should be fun Oh god damn, okay. I'm gonna look over here first. So, uh, I don't have much faith that I'm gonna find a lot of bugs, but we're gonna kind of just guess as we go. Uh, I don't have Jamie's spotlight and there's bugs in my face. Is the camera on? Yes. Okay. I'm not that bad, <laughs> good lord. Also, uh, I'm not photographing spiders because they scare me. Uh, so I'm at a bit of a disadvantage. Uh, if it's the only thing I can find, I will firm a spider, but... Mm. It's still that spider that I was photographing a minute ago. I can't remember where it was. I said, oh, yo, I found a spider. I said I wasn't going to do it, but you know what? I don't have much faith that I'm going to find anything else, so I'm facing my fears. Oh, he's moving. Now, don't wiggle that bum, bro. Just stay where you are. Please don't drop or anything. Just, just, just kind of chill there for me, little dude. Just kind of chill there for me. Oh, yo, we have something. We have something. Okay. I'm a crouch. Get nice and close to this bad boy. My knees are soaking wet, but it is fine. I'm not even focused on the spider, I'm focused on a plant. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> no! I was going to say, I didn't think that looked like the spider for a moment. We spent about 20 minutes just trying to photograph this one spider. I'm determined to get a good shot of the spider. It's the last thing I do. It's not in focus. Shoot. in focus. Yep. Let's get on to the next one. Kill. Cool. And... Don't tell me 10 minutes. minutes left. Oh, that's not too bad. I don't know what that is. I think it's a dragonfly, but it looks kind of cool. That is a crane fly. A crane fly. Oh, wow. As I said earlier, these are a bit hard to photograph, so I will be impressed if you get a photo here. He's gone. He no slug. There's one there. The slug. Oh. I'm helping you out here. No, yeah, yeah. We'll get a slug. <laughs> slug time. Oh, don't jiggle. That actually seemed to be in focus. I'm gonna get one more. Cool. Slug done. Right. More like a fly or something. A nice fly would be good. Damn. If I can find like two more good ones, then I will be happy. There's another slug. But I don't want to do another slug. There's another, another slug. How many slugs? I'll try and grab this dude first because he's more likely to fly away first. His leg just swung <laughs> a little bit closer. Come on, I'm so close. I got it. Nice. Oh, not a snail. Hey, little guy. Do. No. Got my arm then. <laughs> Had the judders. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit. Alright. I want one more. And I'm feeling. I'm feeling like a fly. Maybe, maybe. Was it big? Was it a big spider? Oh! Mm. I'm gonna firm it. I'm gonna firm it. Damn it. I just took a picture of the sky. I don't know. Oh, there Yeah, I think I got one there. Cool. One in there somewhere. I'm getting away from that thing. That's a good attempt, to be honest. We've got four minutes left. 
One more. I can get one more. I'm doing better than I thought I would, actually. Right. Is it worth getting another one of them? Yeah. It's in a good spot, I'm not going to lie. Oh, no. There's two there. There's one there. That's the one I'm going for. Is he still there? Good spot. Oh, yeah, he's still there. It's going to get it perfect. I think I got some there. You might be far from the bush. Oh. Oh yeah, that's definitely him. I think I was photographing the bush the whole time. Cool, I think I got one there. Alright, one more. Let's see if I can squeeze one more in. How long have I got? One minute and twenty two seconds. Okay. I'm not doing another one of them. I've got two already. Oh no. I'd get searching oh. We rush. We rush. Thinking of a fine one that's gonna take me about two minutes just to get it in focus. You something. No. Ah, uh, come on, please. I need one more. Seventeen. Six. No! Eight, don't do that to me! Stress me out! No! Um <gasps> Slug! No! I found a slug at the last second! My dude was just hidden between. So one. Yeah, I was photographing a plant. We ignore that. Two, three, four, five, six. Six? Six. Two less than you. That's not too bad. Nice. I'm quite happy with that, you know. Yeah. I think I did quite well. Right then, so as you can see, I won by only, what was it, two images? Three images? Two. Two images. Which, to be honest, I, I thought he might get one or two um, when I first saw him using the camera. I did give him a little like tutorial before we started, but nothing more than showing him how to set focus on a bug. And I did give him the settings, so he didn't have to think about settings or anything. But I think he did a, a very good job, to be honest. Thank you. And uh, the whole point of this video is to kind of show that gear doesn't always matter. It's more about knowing how to approach subjects and yeah how to get the photo rather than having fancy gear yeah i must say <laughs> i do like having my uh, camera back now to some extent um gear does matter if you want to take something from this video so yeah that was a uh, quite a fun experiment and i uh, hope you enjoyed that it would have been better if i did it like a few months ago when it was prime macro season but yeah we're going into early september now and there's not many bugs around so i'm thinking for the next few videos i probably might do um some like woodland photography, macro, mushrooms and stuff. Because there's a lot less bugs around really. But um, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, share, comment, all that stuff. And um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.